let's grab some boxes and have some fun guys star uh, star wars video games that is a great great shirt muhammad ali love that this it looks brand new in here guys okay how about that comment below if you know what that is i have no clue this is going to be a decent sell right here i thought oh was this a handgun maybe this is like feels like it's mounted it looks very high end this is sounds german or something william turner it's like a boat battery charger that's my guess that looks kind of nice okay oh hawaii very nice there we go there we go All right, what's up, Locker Nuts? Are you ready? It's Locker time, and we're gonna get back to this one. This is that huge 10 by 25 unit that I bought just a few days ago. Oh, I'm looking forward to this. It's, it's a good one. In fact, I think it might be the most exciting one I bought this year, at least from the looks of it. I think it might also be the most expensive one I bought this year. I'm not positive, but I think it might be. Excitement alert, excitement alert. That's what we got. There is actually some stuff that I, I took out of our uh, the other unit I got. I had bought it the day before online, blah, blah, blah. Go back a few videos, you'll see what I'm talking about. There's tons of Legos. Well, there's a few things like the computers and those shelves that came out of that unit. I shoved them in here because I knew I was coming back for a flea market load. Um, yeah, we started going through the boxes there. We cleaned out, we've processed all this stuff here. We've already looked at, kind of taking a peek at this stuff here. But guys, look at this. This entire back is just, there could be anything back there. There could be a motorcycle back there. I don't think there could be a car back there, but there could be almost anything back there. So much potential. There is boxes almost to the ceiling, and I do see a little bit of furniture up there, but so far we haven't seen much furniture at all unless you include shelves, and I don't include shelves because I like shelves and I don't like furniture. Unless it's mid-century. This is not going to be a mid-century furniture uh, locker. I can already tell. This guy was definitely, he's like a mechanic. He liked the barbecue. He had tools, RC cars. I don't think that's the mid-century uh, stereotype. Uh, but I could be completely wrong, right? But I do try to profile, you know, what buyers are into, what their interest is. I'm not feeling that mid-century. But we found some Nike Air Jordans already. There's some Nike boxes. But we found Air Jordans in bags over here. Vinyl records over there. Oh, we got a safe. Did we mention that? No. There it was a safe it's at home i still haven't opened it i meant to at the beginning of this video but time's getting away from me guys I... <laughs> there we go oh okay oh there's something in here we work a lot we had a late night whatnot auction last night and i was packing till almost 1 a.m so um but anyways i was looking forward to this we're here i'm already a little sweaty because um i cleaned out a 20 dollar unit that i got upstairs in this building and uh that was in the previous video that was not like this one this one i wanted i'm excited that one i didn't really want but for 20 bucks i took it i knew i could get in this trailer and i do have the trailer today <laughs> That looks full. It's really not. It's really not. In fact, this is all empty boxes and garbage cans. I'll leave whatever we don't fill in the unit. Up to that bed is pretty compact. This couch is a real pain because it's just, mm, it doesn't fit well. It takes up so much space, but we're going to get a lot on here. We're not going to get all this on there. No sirree. I think this is uh, this trailer load and another complete trailer load to empty this unit. That's what I think. But uh, anyways, let me qu quit talking. Let's get to it because I've been looking forward to this. First, I'm going to just clean out all this stuff that we already processed that is waiting to go to the flea market. We're going to do that first. And we'll go from there. All right, guys, this is coming together. Coming together. Got that big mattress right here. Help fill that void. Stack on top of it. It's coming together. It's a little bit of comforter was at a bedspread in, or no sleeping bag sorry sleeping bag i'll put some soft stuff in there like clothes or whatever yeah yeah that's a much better huh got a nice little workstation <laughs> look at this huge pile of stuff this is all garbage cans and empty boxes mostly a little bit of good stuff i pulled out but um most i, I think it's like every garbage can that i own so far this this locker has had a lot of garbage like we're going through the boxes up here this stuff a lot of garbage they didn't exactly throw stuff away it's another one of these lockers seems to be common pretty common uh they just don't throw garbage away they pack it in with their good stuff and yeah i've never figured it out i'll never figure that out um i brought lots of garbage cans so i can uh filter here so we don't have to bring too much garbage to the flea market and uh, i might even make a dump run separate i usually don't do that anymore i used to but um yeah let's start digging guys let's start getting into it okay all right guys let's get started oh i think we saw this already did we already go through this no 
Not this one. Did we? Maybe. <laughs> they start to look the same. Yeah, empty box. Sometimes, sometimes those Altoid boxes have something good. And what is this? What is this? This has got some weight to it. Tech Theory. Huh. I think it's the a stand for your phone right there. I think that might be what it is. Huh. Your tablet or something? That's kind of interesting. I'm gonna put that aside. All right. The rest of it. The rest of it. Oh wait, wait, wait. What's this? What's this? Baltimore Police Department. That. Oh, it's Crybaby. That's Johnny Depp, I think. Crybaby shirt. Ugh, I can't believe it. I was almost gonna pass it over, and that's that's the best piece of clothing in that bag. So good. More paperwork. It's kind of stuff I saying they just don't throw it away for some reason. They really should have. Yeah. Oh, there's another glove. Oh my goodness. How many gloves is that? There, We found, I think, three or four single gloves the other day, and there's another single glove. I swear this guy was like one-handed. <laughs> just, I don't think he is, but, oh, funny, Fat Farm. Uh, the only reason that's funny is I found a Fat Farm sweatpants in the upstairs unit just an hour ago. Body lotion. All right, well, that was mostly mail in that basket. Basket's a couple bucks. It's not bad at all. Hmm. This is heavy duty mats. Like, oh, it's by Motor Trend. Car mats. Something else there. Oh. Star Wars Battlefront. That's cool. Oh, neat. A couple posters. Okay. Star, uh, Star Wars video games. Posters. Last placement. Some copper wire right there. Actually, I think it's LEDs. Yeah, that's what it is, LEDs. Okay, what else we got? Happy Father's Day from Grogu. Solo, that's neat. Okay, and some whiteboards. All right, got a bunch of cabling here. Um, hmm. I wonder if he's gonna scrap these, or if he was really using this. Couple of speakers. That's a nice chunk of aluminum right there, but huh, looks expensive, whatever that was for. Alright, a bunch more clips. These are great. I love these clips, especially these metal ones. And <laughs> some more uh, gloves. I wonder if there's one of each again. And some rags at the bottom. A little bit of sandpaper. All right, let's see what's in these. I've said it many times before, I kind of like these little plastic things because, I don't know, we just have some luck with those. We find good stuff, meaning like jewelry, very, very often. The wire, Hanes, that's cool. I'll put that aside. It's definitely a, a t-shirt with the print on it and I think it could be something a little better. Okay, look at this. Malcolm X, by any means necessary, another t-shirt. That is a great, great shirt. Muhammad Ali, love that. Easy -E, Compton, that's cool. Tupac, this goes with some decent stuff in here, guys. No joke, this is a little bit, this is some good stuff. I think we get $10 each on a lot of those, maybe not all of them. I pulled some styrofoam out of the upstairs unit, and the reason is because when we're packing and shipping, I use that for void fill. It's much better than, you know, putting in the landfill, if I can chop that up and use it. Much, much, much better. Wow, this is another Hustle City of Angels. Hustler, okay, that's cool. This is good, guys. Some good stuff here. Just a white t-shirt there. Another Tupac, that was, that's cool. It looks vintage, because it looks like it's faded out from being washed a lot of times, but it's not a single stitch. It's still neat. Another great shirt. That one doesn't look like it was used much. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Oakland Raiders National Football League Lee Sport. That's a that's a neat looking sweatshirt right there. Size medium. I like it. Raider Nation. Yeah, baby. San Jose Sharks. Another good shirt. That was a big one too. Nike shorts right here. Ah, oh, bummer. They got a looks like a cigarette burn right there. Hole in them. It's too bad. Those are cool. Otherwise, Russell Athletic. Russell Athletic. All right, this is a good bin, guys. We got at least 10 shirts, maybe a dozen that I think 10 bucks each on. That's 120 bucks out of that thing, plus whatever we sell this for and the rest of the shirts. More. Oh, yes, guys. All right. 
Oh, I like that. It's been a while since I found a uh, jar of coins, and that's not very many, but that still gets me happy, happy, happy. Uh, some kind of charger right there. I'm not sure for what. Organic hemp, raw. The unrefined rolling papers. It's a little ashtray, I think. Adult Mad Libs with Snoop Dogg. That's funny. That's too bad. Look at that. Those are little dividers for cards, trading cards, but there's none in here. Just blank pages, but that's kind of a good sign. I mean, look at this composition book and then a decomposition books. <laughs> it's just funny. I don't know why I think it's funny. Those are not even written in. I'm going to definitely have to sell those. Can canvas bag is kind of cool. Smith and Hawken, but strap's broken, so yeah, it's not that cool. You know, that chair is actually quite nice. It's got a little bit of scratches here and stuff, but the design on it's nice. And I see one, two, three more right here. Three more. That's a good sign. What else we see in here that we're in a little bit deeper? I don't. I see a bunch of lids here for totes and the five gallon bucket. I don't really see anything. I don't know what this is right here. Um, I don't really see anything that's worth commenting on. I see totes and bags. Nothing uh, identifiable, which is fine. We're just gonna have to keep digging Let's with this right here. There's some sort of rags or something. Okay. What's this? Okay. Looks like makeup stuff. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Juniper? Nope. Yeah. Thought maybe gift cards, but they're room keys. That's just a yeah. Comfort in. Dang it. Where they stayed at a lot of a lot of hotels. Fire starter. I'm the fire starter. A wicked fire starter. Put that aside. <laughs> kind of neat. Face masks. Oh, look at this. Alcatel. I think this is a mobile hotspot. I think that's what it's for. I'll put that aside too. Ooh, now what is this? Huh, that looks like uh, like for a hedge trimmer or something. You know, for your bushes, landscaping. Very strange to be in here. <laughs> okay. Ooh, ooh, okay. Yeah, I know what this is. That is a pressure washer and, okay. This, it looks brand new in here, guys. What the heck? How about that? So what do you say? I think 50 bucks at the market? That's what I'm thinking. Let's hope. What is this? Glass. What would that be for? Is that a drug thing? Is that like a, some sort of a pipe? I don't know, guys. That's weird. Carpet and rug dry cleaner. Nah, probably not pipe. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe part to a rug cleaner. Diatomaceous earth right here. Ant and crawling insect killer. This is good stuff. Plant food, Dr. Earth, insect killer. See what I mean? They just have a lot of garbage though. In with their other stuff. Look at this empty bag. Purple candy cane, what? Some kind of cannabis thing right here. Huh. Weird. Okay, I decided I'm gonna wait on this right here. I know I'll sell this so easy, so easy at uh, Stockton flea market, but Magnaflow, I think that, eh, that's, that's just a sticker. What is this box? Oh, it's a Craftsman. Okay. Wow. It's actually a really nice box. Hmm. Tempted to upgrade mine. But anyways, I'll wait on that because I think I'd have a lot more luck selling it locally. I just don't know if I want to deal with it. Um, this right here, Craftsman, another piece that I'll probably sell locally because I get so much more money than at the market, but it'll sell at the market for sure. This is definitely uh, something I probably want to take home and test. Great piece, great piece. Okay, this is cool. Budweiser mirror, Sierra Nevada sign, and, okay. Yeah, that's kind of neat. Oh, okay, this thing, which on the top, I thought it was like an ice machine if you have an injury. I was wrong. It's a washing machine. What is this? Costway, washing machine. Is that, is that really for like clothes? Such a little thing in there. Ice, it says, max min ice. Wait, I don't understand this. What's that for then? Huh. What's that? What would you be washing in ice? Huh. Interesting. Item number EP23104. Do you guys know what this is? Comment below if you know what that is. I have no clue. Hmm. Hmm. Hey, here. 
It's a decal. No, is it a decal? No? Hmm. Oh, all right. I wonder what they're into. All right. And then we've got the um, lawnmower. And check this out. I thought it was an airfield or something. It, uh, Briggs & Stratton is the engine. Craftsman. That's what it is. Six and a half horsepower lawnmower. Very good, guys. Another really good piece. Probably, again, something I should bring home. List locally for probably, I don't know, 150 bucks if it works. I think. I don't know. Okay, I got the broken neon sign out. Let's see what else we got in here. CBG Isolate. CBG. I don't know if that's like CBD. It's just a bunch of screws and stuff in there. Oh, this is good. That's wedged in there. Power inverter. 1000. That's cool. You hook that to your car battery and you can plug stuff in. That's neat. CBG distillate pellets. What's CBG, guys? Let me know. Is, is it like CBD? I don't, I don't know. I have no clue, but I'm not, I'm not keeping it. Uh, this smoker is, this is going to be a decent sell right here. This, I mentioned this in the last video. I looked these up before because I saw it in the photo. I looked it up before we even bid on this unit. And yeah, it's definitely, definitely been used, but uh, this is kind of how you expect it to be. This is probably six or seven hundred bucks brand new, so decent uh, find. And I'm not sure, I'm not sure I'm going to sell that just yet. I'll wait and see. All right, guys, I got the smoker out, and boy, look at this thing. This thing is really nice. It's got all this. Really nice, really nice. You could tell it's a quality piece, and uh, dang, I like this. Okay, so <laughs> I just asked Jen on the phone, hey, do we want a sm smoker? And she's like, well, in theory, yes, but we just don't cook enough meat. So probably, I'm going to bring that home. So here's the deal, guys. I only got like another hour here. I got to fill as much in there as I can. I need this full. So I go to the market this week with the full trailer. And also, like I was saying, I think this is going to take the rest of that trailer full and a whole you know second trailer trip i don't want to make three trips here i want to make two trailer trips so anyways i gotta come back tomorrow so um i'm bringing this home overnight so if i'm doing that i'm gonna throw that on there and i'm gonna get the compressor and i'm gonna get the lawnmower i'd really like to get the tool thing but i i don't know maybe i will I want to bring home stuff that I can list. I might even list it as soon as I get home. And this washing machine, this is a portable washing machine apparently. And they are like a couple hundred bucks new, I believe. So I'm going to take my time on that. I'm not going to rush it to the uh, stock and flea market. This ice maker right here, I got to find out if there's a fridge in here. All right. Uh, and then behind this, check this out. I thought this is a box spring. I just saw the this. I thought this is a box spring. That's just a moving blanket. And I, I don't know what all this is. See all these things right here? That looks like a TV mount what's this oh that's a tv what the heck how is it mounted up here panasonic hmm okay <laughs> all right that is what it is what is that vacuum i'm not sure what that is cordless looks nice Look at this, you guys. Up on top of that, I found this right here. Chicago electric welding mask. It looks like a really nice one. This is probably one of the nicest ones I've found. It is plastic, but uh, it looks brand new. The inside of it looks really new. I also found this Sierra Nevada beer sign. Looks like it lights up, it plugs in. It does have damage right here, and it does look a little faded, like it saw some sunlight. And then I found this up there. Little, I thought, oh, was this a handgun maybe? Nope, but it's a cigar. It's a little cigar case. It's a humidor basically. You got the little thing right there for moisture. And surprisingly, it doesn't feel super dried out. It's actually okay. Kind of interesting, the guy at the desk up there was just telling me that the previous owner would come here and he's like, you know, he knew he was going late because he kept going late and paying up and going late. And he's like, but he come here with this car and he's like, and we never see him loading anything. He'd just come in here and just hang out. And he's like, I wouldn't be surprised if you find some party favors in there. He's like, cause I think he just went in there and partied. And I was like, you know what? Actually we did find empty bottles of wine and some hard liquor and some marijuana stuff in here already. So I'm like, yeah, I think he did do a little partying in here. So <laughs> whatever, this is like, feels like it's mounted it might just be extremely heavy and just sitting on there on the little brackets for the wall mount I don't think it could be watching TV in here maybe it's watching TV in here too I don't know I don't feel real great about that but 
I think it's okay. I think, I hope it's okay. Okay, I still got a little bit of time to uh, go through stuff, but I don't want to get caught here and pack this haphazardly. So I went ahead and strapped everything in. I think, I think it's pretty good. Look at this. It's great. I mean, ideally, it has some void fill there, have some void fill here. I think it's good though. I think it is good. Not great, but good. So I'm gonna bring this home, sell local, sell local, sell local. And this, I think I'll sell local. I was saying I was not gonna bring it home, but now I'm thinking I have the empty space. Do it, get it done, get her done, get her done. Okay, that'll come out later. Um, Cause that's gonna wanna go right on the trailer and I don't wanna strap that on. Let's grab some boxes and have some fun guys. Okay, let's see. Oh, and I wanted to point out something I saw. Look at this right here. True religion, yeah, that's good. True religion jeans, good stuff. We do, we do look for that. We hope to find that. Oh, Xbox. That's a, I think an Xbox One controller. Ooh, things are looking up. Bow, bow. Things are looking up. Okay, what do we got in here? Ah, oh, okay. Wait, I was, I was gonna say a nice looking clock, but it's messed up but it's not there's just he put led lights in it to give it a little bit more light i guess he was a tinkerer some screws and some zip ties and nice pliers right there the box is cool too oh this is heavy belkin what is this is this a wire a wire a wireless router battery backup unit okay that's why it's so heavy Huh. That's good for Christmas lights. Plug them in, plug them in, plug them in. Okay, what do we got? What do you think is Christmas stuff? Yeah. Yeah, Christmas stuff. Huh. That's funny. Camouflage Santa's hat. <laughs> I like it. Been there series. Ooh, Starbucks. Oh, look at this. Oh, cool. California. Been there series. Okay, a little tiny cup. Souvenir pieces. That's kind of neat. I'll put that aside. That's something a little bit better. The rest of it is like me. Okay, ripped open bags can go in the garbage. Obviously. What else we got in here? Oh, we got some nice stockings. Those are some... Those are good. Those are decent quality. Yeah. Alright, that's cool. <coughs> some kind of cookware that's kind of nice that is nice six bucks at the market that's what I say six <laughs> okay. this piece right here that was adding so much weight to this I think that's off one of those scooters right maybe I don't know that's pretty heavy duty Oh, these are bags. Bags and bags and bags and bags. Huh. Solar light. Batteries. And more solar lights here. What's this? Fine art inkjet paper. Whoa. Oh, this is this is something good right here. Uh, potentially. It looks very high end. This is I think this is for those high uh, those very large inkjet printers. Wow. Okay, they're both sealed brand new. Let's try to get a, a comp on this. Hmm, there's the brand. Sounds German or something. William Turner. Reference number 10641477. And this one's reference number 10641416. A little bit different. It's got some, some kind of funky stuff on here. I kept a couple towels just in case and I'm glad I did. That might be stuff to go on eBay right there. I'm gonna put it aside. Wait, where's our put aside pile? Over here maybe? Fiberglass wire running kit, 33 feet, okay. There's some kind of star map right there. Sandpaper, ship and store, built for charging. I don't, ship and shore, ship and shore. Okay, it's like a boat battery charger, that's my guess. That looks kind of nice. SC 1360 from Shoemaker, Shoemaker, hmm. Might need to look that up. It looks brand new. I don't think he used it. He probably bought that for the quad that was in here. Wet shoes. What's this? Carrying mill. It's a flashlight. So 
some really nice Milwaukee bits right here. Not very many left. Oh, there's a penny. There's not many left in here. It's a nice set, though. I'll let that go to the market. Some j good jumper cables and flashlights. Rivet gun, I think this is. Thanks for riveting. Sketchers playing cards. Craftsman, okay. Kobe time. Hmm, it's got a snooze on there. I think it's a alarm clock, but look at all this these uh, USB and electrical ports on there. It's neat. Alright, well, that can all go to the market. Let's see why. Okay, electric pump for air mattresses. A tarp. Okay, what? Brush strokes. Wow, that's, yeah, okay. That's some serious business there. It's for getting those hard to reach spots, apparently. Okay, this is the weight right here. And that's some kind of a car part right there. Wow, heavy. Yeah, got some other stuff too. There's a brand new tarp, eight by 11. We're not gonna sell that, not right away. Ooh, there's a skill saw. Nice, nice. Oh, batteries in here. Jeez. And some cords and mouse for the computer. It says miscellaneous stuff. Let's see if it is. Airflow. It's a backpack, but it's got a lot of tears on it. That's too bad. It looked like it was probably a nice one to begin with. It's been thrashed. It's spray adhesive. That's could be trouble. <laughs> okay, oh, Hawaii, very nice, and Texas. Found a bunch of plates in the first day of digging here, and that's good, I'll put those aside. We're gonna keep those plates to put into a live auction. Oh, man, this is definitely miscellaneous stuff. Um, so yeah, guys, we do a live auction on whatnot. Uh, we talk about every video, you probably already know. Hey, this is a nice little bag right here. That's all right. Um, yeah, so we're gonna really try to pull out the best stuff in this unit and that's hopefully in there because this part here has not been so great But there I see video games. We see good stuff over there true religion jeans that kind of stuff We would put into our whatnot auction Let's see auto parts here That's what I'm digging for I'm digging for the treasures that we can put into the live auctions and that's what whatnot is it's a live streaming auction app for your phone tablet computer whatever but oh client tools another good piece client tools good money good good money okay i'll put that aside if you use your mobile device for it though it's going to be a lot better experience because that's what it's built for that's where you can go and like win stuff we do giveaways and those are fun a lot of fun giveaways mm -hmm. it's really Oh, Traxxas, this is a uh, TRX power charger. This is for the remote control car right here. Hmm, we found the body for it. We'll probably find the remote control car too. I, I think we will. Yeah, we do the live options like every Thursday um, or almost every Thursday. And guys, it is a lot of fun. It really, really is. We go live, we sell like 125 to 150 lots every night that we go live and we move quick we sell everything and starting at one dollar and our auctions are like 20 seconds so we show the item we start the auction 20 second later boom it's sold you can pick up some great stuff you can pick up some great deals 20 second long auctions start it sell it boom done Ooh, 2008 tahoe suburban that might be a little bit of value right there and uh yeah so we oh this is sealed right here sealed i'm gonna put that aside mama mia Little League Baseball. Got some photos in here. Oh, I gotta go through this stuff better. I feel like I'm rushing. Photos, got a little box down there. So we can get that back to the owner. Ben Areza. Okay. Yeah, but we don't put anything in there. We're only gonna put our best stuff in there. Only the best. Simply the best. And... If that's a little iPhone, that might be something we lot up and put in the auction. I was really trying to find this, though. This right here. It's not silver, though. Okay, what's this? Oh, chains for your car. All right, that's why it's silver. Oh, those are nice, though. They don't even look used. Cobra ca cable chains. 
the heck? That is really nice. Man. All right. Well, we'll bring it to Stockton. Probably get a couple bucks if we're lucky. What's this thing? A little purse? <laughs> With another purse inside the purse. That's kind of neat. It looks hand embroidered. All right, let's pull those out. Let's pull those out. Let's pull this out. And this, and this. We'll put that in our keeper box. Right here. Doesn't look like a keeper box, but it is. We'll go through that second pass. The rest of it's gonna go back in here and go to the flea market. And with that, guys, I'm out of time. I think this is probably gonna be a short video because I didn't even get through that much. We did make some progress here. Can't say I feel good about how much progress. I was not hoping to come back here tomorrow. Is that a proper grammar? I was hoping to not come back here tomorrow, but I will. And I'm not, that's okay. It's fun and I like taking my time. Uh, the one upstairs took me a little bit longer. I got a late start, blah, blah, blah. But tomorrow I got nothing. Go to some garage sales maybe in the morning and head over here. Jana and the girls are going to the Taylor Swift concert tomorrow. They're so excited. Uh, they are really, 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 really excited. So that's a big deal in our household. Um, but I'm not going. I don't, yeah, I don't, I don't care for the music. It's not my thing. And uh, I wouldn't spend that kind of money anyways. But uh, I'll be here. This is what I like to do. This is my Taylor Swift right here. This is what I get excited about. And whew, I think you guys are too. If you're here watching this, I think you're excited about this too. Because look at this. This is all potential right here. All potential. Potential. That looks like a dresser. Her daughter Faith's getting married in a couple months. She asked for a dresser. Maybe, maybe that'll work. All right, I just wish the quality of the stuff was a little better. Condition, rather, I should say. A lot of the stuff is messed up. Stuff he should have thrown away. She should have thrown away. I think it's a boyfriend, girlfriend. But anyways, guys, I got only a few minutes. I got to throw all this in here. I can do it. We can do it. Okay, let's wrap it up. We'll be back tomorrow in the next video, which will be out soon. Until then, good luck to you. God bless you. We'll see you next time here on Loganets. Okay, let's get in here. <laughs> it's not exactly going the way I wanted it to. It's kind of going in instead of out, but... There we go. There we go. Oh yeah. Come on. Now I've managed to get that lip out. And it's now being an obstacle. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. There we go. Come on, boy. <laughs> there we go. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. There's something in here. There is something in here. First of all, that's what's rattling around is batteries. But what's this? What is this? Okay. A monthly planner that is blank. <laughs> No, not, okay, not totally blank, but mostly blank. What? All right, yeah, it's probably all his passwords and stuff. Hey, that's what he had locked up, huh? Hmm. All right, well, sorry, guys. It's not more exciting than that, but still fun. Okay, starting out with the phone. It's a big phone. Corner's macked up though. See that? Gee, it's a Google phone. We'll put it in this, the box. Why not?